Okay, so we've got a big, big, big global data download to talk about today. It was over 900 megabytes, if I remember correctly. And some of you guys are probably wondering, what was all this data? Like, why was it so massive? So that is exactly what I'm gonna tell you in this video. Now, of course, before we jump in, I wanna give a shout out to my boy Proton10MG on Twitter for posting all the assets. Uh, if you guys aren't already following him, then definitely go ahead and do so. I'm sure this one in particular took a very long time. So uh, yeah, go follow him. And with that said, let's just jump right into it. We're starting here with the Awakenings and Extremes Awakenings for the free-to-play Go Tanks failure units, the Bat Go Tanks, and also the Skinny Go Tanks. From there, we have some uh, Awakenings and Extreme Z Awakenings for some World Tournament units. So this Goku, it's getting a Token Awakening, or this is the Token Awakening. And then we have four Extreme Z Awakenings for the Super Saiyan Goku, this Bardock, this uh, Super Saiyan 2 Gohan, and also the Kid Goku. So four World Tournament Extreme Z Awakenings and one World Tournament Token Awakening. After that, we have the token awakening, or sorry, extreme Z awakening medal for LR Piccolo. Um, he is absolutely awful right now, so this definitely uh, helps a lot. And uh, you can purchase these medals in the Baba Shop. And we also have some World Tournament extreme Z awakening medals, and uh, these will be used to extreme Z awaken the World Tournament units outside of the Piccolo, of course. Um, this is. Uh, or, or these are the new stages for the uh, Go Tanks failure strike event. We got stages four to six, and the bonus drop category is heavenly events. And uh, these will be the stages where we get the awakening medals as well as the extreme C awakening medals for the uh, two Go Tanks failures. So uh, there's an awakening medal for the fat Go Tanks. There's the one for the skinny Go Tanks. We have the extreme Z awakening medals as well for each of the go tanks is and then we have some world tournament preview stuff right the standard banners that we get for every world tournament which is starting on uh the 21st so in about two days uh, i'm thinking about doing a stream this time just because it's been a while and i kind of miss talking to you guys so uh, i think i'm trying i'm gonna try to set that up um soon uh what is this what is this? I actually didn't notice this right here. Uh, this is, oh, Hercules autograph, Hercules autograph. So I guess it's a new item. Um, I didn't notice this on the JP side actually. So I'm not a hundred percent sure what it's for. I gotta be honest, but I'm assuming we can exchange these for probably some kind of item in the Baba shop. Maybe, you know, your standard like uh, Elder Kai's and trading items, training locations, support items, stuff like that. That's what I'm assuming because I'm not too sure about this one. So that's my bad. It's my bad. But from there, we have a new Peton Battle Series Pack, Series 9 and 10, available on the 24th. So that's going to be when the next Peton Battle starts. And then we have this Whirling Cherry Blossom uh, ticket. And as Proton says, uh, it's a treasure available for a limited time, can be exchanged for a secret treasure chest at Baba's shop. So uh, to me, it sounds like we're getting skill orbs for these tickets, uh, maybe for a specific category, maybe just for any category. But uh, the point is, the most, import most important takeaway is that this is not a summoning ticket. So it's not for any particular banner. It is for the Baba shop and for a secret treasure chest. So we got that ticket right there and from there so this basically sums up everything we're getting right now the world tournament stuff the uh you know awakenings and extreme z awakenings for some free-to-play units all that good stuff but everything beyond this is uh untranslated assets for the upcoming anniversary which is roughly well, less than three months away actually so it's getting pretty close and they're starting to add a lot of assets from the anniversary to prepare for the celebration just so they don't have to do you know like a three gigabyte data download when 
uh, the anniversary comes around, right? So uh, yeah, just to be very clear, these are not gonna be released soon. Okay, they're coming in a couple months when the anniversary starts, but they are in the game now as untranslated assets. So we're starting with the free-to-play Goku with the Dragon Balls. He is the free-to-play anniversary unit for this year with Shenron in the back, looking amazing. And then we have the uh, assets for the Dual Tokan Fest LRs, right? So we got the Super Saiyan 3 Goku, and Vegeta, the SSR, the TUR, and also the LR. And then we also have this Spirit Bomb Goku as well. And then for the other side, the other unit, we have the GT Goku and Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, SSR, TUR, and also LR. And then the exchange into the uh, Saiyan Ru, I guess, with the Vegeta, Trunks, uh, Gohan and uh, Goten, and also the Spirit Bomb Goku in the back. Uh, is it an exchange? It's not really an exchange. It's more of the uh, the standby skill, right? So uh, yeah, the dual Dokkan Fest LRs are technically in the data files now, but not ready for release until the anniversary. And then we have some side units. We got this Gotenks and Piccolo, SSR and TUR. And then we also have a couple of Shenrons right there, the uh, Nova Shenron and Ice Shenron. And uh, now we have this Hercule free-to-play unit. There's the SSR, TUR. We have the free-to-play Bobbity, uh, SSR, TUR, and also LR, because this is an LR Bobbity that also goes into a Majin Vegeta through the standby skill. So uh, yeah, more anniversary assets right there. We have some Extreme Z Awakening or Extreme Z Battle assets for the uh, Fizz Super Vegito, the SDR Super Boo, the LR Spirit Bomb Absorb Goku, and also Super Saiyan Blue Kaken Goku. A bunch of untranslated maps for various events that we're about to get uh, with the upcoming anniversary. Uh, this one looks really cool, King Kai's Planet, I like that one. Uh, and then, you know, some more maps right there. Destroyed City, some, you know, landscapes, all that good stuff. More of the same, well, not the same, but, you know, similar. Uh, more Destroyed Cities, got, got a nice beach here. Uh, man, there's a lot of maps. Okay, so I'm not gonna, you know, stay too much or spend too much time on these. We got a Hyperbolic Time Chamber. But uh, you guys get the point. Yeah, a lot of maps because we are getting many, many uh, events for the anniversary, right? So uh, it makes sense that we get a lot of backdrops. Although, to be honest, I don't really notice the backdrops when I'm doing events, but um, some of these are pretty cool, I gotta say. Okay, more maps. <laughs> more, more maps. And is there anything else? I'm not sure, but I will show you guys all the maps for anyone that wants to wants to see them uh, another hyperbolic time chamber am i just repeating the same ones or are these different oh they're different okay and two more so there you go those are all of the maps uh that we got through the static download i think in total there's like 20 plus probably and then we have some more uh anniversary related things got a couple of uh, Dragon Stones, this is free to play. This is not free to play, as you guys might remember. You have to buy these with stone packs. Uh, we got the anniversary coin, of course. And then uh, we also have some tickets. So this is for the uh, triple guaranteed LR ticket summon. You can collect 50 of these and do a big multi at the end of the anniversary for three guaranteed LRs. This is the rainbow ticket, which can be used on the anniversary uh, banners and they are free to play get them through missions and then we have a couple of uh, untranslated support memories right here and also one more and then we have some awakening medals token awakening medals for the uh, boo saga boys and also the gt boys a couple of more awakening medals for the hercule and two of course for the bobbity because he does go to an lr so there's two different awakenings and then we have the Extreme Z Awakening Medals for the Fizz Super Vegito, the STR Super Boo, the LR uh, Spirit Bomb Absorb Goku, Super Saiyan Blue Kakun Goku, and then the uh, banner assets, the banner assets for the 
Buu, Saga, Goku, and Vegeta. Uh, I don't remember the exact featured units, but these guys will definitely be there. The uh, LR God Boys, of course the side unit, which is the Gotenks and Piccolo. We got Gamma 1 and also LR Final Form Cooler. And then for the uh, GT side, we have the Super Saiyan 4s, the Shenrons, um, the Cooler Movie, Goku and Vegeta, and also Gamma 2. And then we are going to get a lot of scripted assets. Uh, here are some Gokus. Here are some more Gokus. And in case you guys don't know, uh, oh, just, just a big, big old Piccolo head. Um, yeah, in case, you, in case you guys don't know, these scripted assets are essentially just, you know, used for uh, events, right? They're like the cut-ins we see in story events and Dokkan events and all that good stuff. So a couple of Vegeta's, a couple of Super Saiyan 3 Goku's. These are going to be really useful when I make thumbnails for the anniversary. So definitely going to save this uh, Tata download thread right here. Once again, thank you to um proton or for these a uh, couple more scripted assets i think there's gonna be a lot <laughs> i think there's gonna be a lot a couple of yamchas a little baby krillin uh we got more here we go uh oh we got fat go tanks skinny go tanks more gokus without legs i mean no feet i guess on this one uh here is a vegeta from the LR Super Saiyan 2 Angel Vegeta active skill. Got a couple of uh, GT Gokus, some more GT Goku. Got a Piccolo in there. Got a GT Trunks. Another Super Saiyan GT Trunks. GT Vegeta. Uh, Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. GT Gohan. Yep. GT Go 10. Uh, Super Saiyan GT Vegeta, Super 17, Super Saiyan, uh, sorry, GT Go, Go 10, Go, sorry, Gohan, I'm getting confused now, uh, GT Gohan, Sin Shenron, a couple of Nova Shenrons, uh, yep, there we go, GT Go 10, a couple of Youth Bulmas, Youth Gohan, and this is probably going to go on for a while, maybe. Oh, never mind. Just as I said that, it's over. Okay, so these are the final scripted assets. So we have B, we have a Gi, and we have a Dragon. I was kind of hoping that the last thing would uh, rhyme <laughs> because it's B, a Gi, and then Ultimate Shade Run. So uh, those are all of the assets, guys. I really like this. Shenron asset, by the way, I might save that too, just for future use. But um, yeah, that that is everything that we got from the status download, guys. I mean, it's a lot, it's a lot, and that's why it was such a massive, you know, 900 and I think 30 megabyte data download. But most of it is for the future. Most of it is not going to be available until the anniversary. So don't get too excited, but definitely look forward to that for sure and um yeah that's all i gotta say like i said man like uh proton put a lot of work into this he spent a lot of time putting all of these assets in this thread on his page so definitely hit him up with a follow because he deserves it man the man works hard the man is grinding so uh that's it guys thank you so much for watching and let me know in the comments if you guys are excited for the anniversary you probably should be if you're not excited then you probably don't enjoy dokkan that much and um oh one last thing is just uh we got the app update 5.10.0 um i'm not gonna do a separate video for that just because it's very minor it was like i think some optimization for android devices and then uh some minor like user interface uh you know changes or updates and then finally it was like some bug fixes like always right so uh nothing too much to talk about there but there was a lot to talk about in this data download so there you go guys a, a, a long video actually a lot longer than i was expecting but 
we had to get through everything, right? So I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.